Hey, so welcome today. I'm just out here at the uh, dog park. As you can see, there's our, our yellow lab that's red. So not sure how that quite happened, but it's a purebred yellow lab. And it's really cold out, as you can see. I got all my, my snow gear on and stuff. I'm walking the dog and it's freaking cold out. So uh, what I wanted to do is talk to you today about how to rise above. You see, it's like me, where it's really cold out. And it makes it worse as I'm a, I'm a wimp when it comes to cold weather. So, pull this back here. I'm kind of a wimp when it comes to cold weather. And so, but the reason I, I got this going on for video for you is to tell you, you know, how to rise above. Cause see, there's always gonna be garbage in your life, right? It's always gonna be crap. There's always gonna be things like for, uh, like me, uh, like for example, there's always gonna be bad weather. Winter always comes. But you know what? There's always a lot of good. And so I just wanna encourage you today, you may not be where you wanna be or at the level of success with your internet business that you wanna be, but always continue to every day, focus on where you're going, what you wanna do, where you think you wanna go, and focus on that today instead of getting overwhelmed by all the garbage. Because here's the thing, just one sec. Daisy, my dog's taken off. Is that if you can get in the habit of that, What's gonna happen is your journey to get to where you wanna go is gonna be a lot more enjoyable. Not only that, you're gonna have a lot less stress and you're probably gonna achieve those goals for with your traffic, with growing your internet business, all that stuff, a whole lot faster. See, the reality is winter sucks where I live. It really sucks. I mean, it just sucks. And like I said, I'm just a big wimp when it comes to cold weather, um, but it is cold out today and high humidity. Oh, at any rate, but there's a lot of good, and and the fact that I'm lot, we're able to spend a lot of time with our kids in the winter because you can't go outside, uh, get a lot of exercise because you gotta you walk the dog or she she eats drywall. If she doesn't get walked, she'll eat, she starts to eat the walls in our house, and there's, there's a whole pile of good things. And same thing with your internet business. You may not you may be at a job you don't like. You may have traffic that's not maybe converting, but you gotta rise above that, and you gotta think what is the one thing I can do today to increase my conversions? What is the one thing I can do right now to get on the solution side of this and focus on where I wanna go and keep revisiting that and thinking next step, next step, next step. I always got campaigns that aren't converting, aren't working. Instead of dwelling on the crap and be like, oh, I just, I just blew hundreds of dollars and got nothing, no conversions. Say, okay, what good happened? Was the click-through rate high? Maybe I got, I got, you know, my opt-in rate was good, great. Now, what can I do to take this to the next step? How can I rise above this and use that adversity to get me to the next step? Because so often, the, the adversity you have is exactly what's gonna lead you to where you wanna go. For example, when I first started, man, I could not get my sales letter to convert, but you know what? I kept at it. I wrote sales letter and different offers. Hey, Daisy, come here, come back here, get back here, come here, treat, usually works, treat. And, and eventually it did start to convert and things started to turn around. And because of that, I, one of my greatest strengths is my ability, my conversion ability and to get people to, you know, on my list I have really good relationship and really high conversion rates in the markets I'm in. And it wouldn't have happened if I wouldn't have had uh, all those challenges starting out. I, you know, I would have got lazy and never focused on that. So really just wanna encourage you with this video today, rise above the garbage and focus on the next step on what it is you can do right now to take yourself to the next level. What is the one good thing you can focus on to get there? So my hand's freezing and my, so is my face. So we'll talk to you soon. Focus on that next thing.